So I abandoned my channel for nearly a year, and I promise I didn't want to, but in a minute you'll understand why I really didn't have another choice. Last year I released my game Choo Choo Charles on Steam, and you guys showed it a ton of love and support, but despite the great launch, a lot of you guys weren't actually able to play it because it was only available on PC. And of course I couldn't let that slide because I'd been promising a console release for pretty much the entire year that I was working on the game. So I had to find a way to make it happen. But unfortunately, it turned out to be a lot more difficult than I was expecting. So about a month after the PC release, when I'd finished fixing all of the bugs and I'd put out some patches and some updates, I talked with tons of publishers and porting studios, and I spent months in going through contracts and lawyering and negotiating to try and find someone that could make this happen. I needed someone that could port the game to Xbox One, Xbox Series X, PlayStation 4 and 5, and Nintendo Switch, all by the end of the year. So after months of searching, I decided to contract Warp Digital to port the game for me. They've done work on games like Return of the Obra Dinn, Human Fall Flat, and Dune Awakening. So now that I'd found somebody capable, it, we now start the, uh, the long process of actually porting the game. I really don't even know how much stuff I can even talk about because of how strict Xbox, PlayStation, and Nintendo are with all of their NDAs. Even when it comes to little things like scheduling the release date, which I'll get to in a second. And all of these NDAs are the main reason that I really haven't been active at all. Like kind of just seemingly dead. Like pretty much every time that something interesting happens, it's under NDA, so I can't talk about it or make a video about it. And when something I can talk about happens, it's just boring and and it wouldn't make a good video at all. For example, it was cool getting the dev kits and getting the game set up and running on them, but I can't actually show you. <laughs> So I had to go to Walmart and just to get like normal retail consoles so that I could show you gameplay clips like this. POV, it's Christmas morning and mommy and daddy just got you Juju Charles on Xbox. Wow. Eugene can be so big on your screen. He is so massive. Oh, my genuine first reaction. Oh, this is insane. Oh. So as you could, I mean, of course, see in those clips. The game is running on consoles. The game is running at a solid 60 FPS on PS5 and Xbox Series, and the graphics are pretty much indistinguishable from the PC version. They also got the game optimized to run on last-gen consoles at like a pretty solid 60 FPS with just very minor visual decreases. But again, it's like it's pretty dang close to PC. It looks really good. And of course, Switch is the least performant, but it's running at a pretty consistent 30 FPS throughout most of the game. And while the visuals have taken a little bit of a hit, it's still completely playable. It looks like Choo Choo Charles. And for an open world game like this, I'm honestly really happy with the results. So obviously, if you've got a current gen console, you're going to get the best experience, but all the other consoles are really solid as well. So now, again, because of all the amazing NDAs and stuff, I'm just gonna skip past the last eight months of development and just let you know, Choo Choo Charles is coming to consoles, uh, specifically Xbox One, Xbox Series, PlayStation 4, and PlayStation 5 on December 21st, which if you're watching this video when it's first come out, that's like a week from now, less than a week from now. And the game is releasing on Switch on January 18th, so it's just about a month from now. As for the price, a lot of people have asked me if it's going to be more expensive than the PC version, and no, it's not. It's going to be the exact same price, $20 or $19.99. And if you go to the link in the description, you can wishlist the game on whatever your preferred platform is, Xbox, PlayStation, Nintendo, and then you'll be notified when it releases. I'm also going live here on YouTube as soon as this video drops, so come by and say hi and subscribe.